Peace everybody, Monty back playing some more Train Fever 101. It's been a little while, I've been away, I actually had to do a business trip out to Japan, but I'm back. Uh, I also had my hard drive crash, so it's been a little bit getting things back online. Luckily, I had my games and even some videos uh, backed up, so I was able to edit and release a Train Fever episode about a week ago. Uh, which we worked on building out a new track out to Axminster and actually it was Adlington out here. So we built the cool tunnel track. Now, what I've done a little bit offline to move time forward, we're now already in September of 1892. I'm really wanting to start the next episode as episode 1900. So I want to build out and finish our goods line and passenger line out to Newport. All we have is this little isolated town. It has a tram station set up just so we'd go ahead and get the public moving and used to it. But now it's time to actually build our trains out. We've got 12 and a half million and no debt. Now something I did just spend some money on was I had this new little express loop for the passenger cars to avoid this whole mixed goods madness. Uh, I separated the trains out, I made some goods trains, two of them go to Axminster from the goods line and then two of them also go directly from the goods back home. The one that actually goes to Axminster is the one that's also picking up the uh, lumber. So I might actually add another goods train here. Now my passenger lines, see here's a goods train going here. Uh, the passenger line now, I want to avoid all this. So he does go through this line here, which I might eventually make an express line, but I have this breakout line here, as you can see, not actually right there, right here, and a passenger car will break out and avoid this lumber mill and hit the, up the station. After they hit up the station, they leave and head back the other way. And what I just added was they were getting really blocked up here with the goods and they were slowing the goods down. 21 and 22 are retired, we'll deal with that offline. Uh, now I have this new express line just for the passengers to fly themselves right up over here. So I'm gonna go ahead and make this a one-way road just in case. And yes, it's a track, not a road. But we all get things mixed up. So now it's time to get building because I don't want this episode to stretch out too long and this Newport track line is gonna take some time. So I wanna show you the madness up here. I don't actually show it too much, but here are the contour lines. This is steep madness. Now I could go into my landscaping tools and kind of build some stuff out, maybe help build some tracks up and things like that, some land, uh, but I'm gonna work with what the computer generated um, and go ahead and build up to Newport. My plan for the tracks are as follows. I'm gonna go ahead and grab my stations here. I'm gonna do passengers. And I'm gonna throw my passenger line way up here. Now my opposite guy, my supply guy, he's gonna go over here. So I'm gonna go ahead and just connect them to these roads that are here. I think that'll be easy enough. And my goal here is to somehow swing these guys around and get them to I want to get some bridge system here. Oh, oh, bridge pillar, bridge pillar. There we go. That'll work. Now this is covering this road here. And I want these guys to connect. Now, as you can see, if I just go this way, this is even showing this going full straight down. Uh, it's just a really, really steep pass. So I think, I think I'm gonna have to do some interesting maneuvers here. Uh, so it's gonna do a lot of back and forth stuff. Uh, so I'm actually gonna have the trains hit up the other side of this track. Now these guys, these lines I want to connect because I only want to do two lines out to the main station and I want to have those one-way lines. Uh, so the goods line and the train line will split off at the destinations and be able to you know, help reduce the traffic that way. Uh, that might be a little bit difficult to understand just from my explanation, but you will see what it is as we go. Now this is such a complicated craziness, I want to save this as the Newport 
train system because I have tried to build this out. I did a little bit of a video on it and it just got so clustered and so crazy that I really just canceled and started all fresh again. Now this time I want to at least have a save <laughs> so it doesn't get too crazy if I have to do the same deal again and we have to restart. So let me try to find a good even spot somewhere that's going to be grounded and able to split our lines. So this is looking okay. I'm gonna try to start. I am starting that right on a pretty steep hill. So let's try to do this and then split out. I'm going full upward trend here. So let's let's start making magic here. All right. So this is gonna spin around like this. This guy's gonna spin around. Oh, wouldn't that be cool if I could get that to work? Because I really need to be really nice oh look at this weirdness this is crazy but it might work look at that that slope is not too high um, oh come on how is that too high let's see if I can really oh that is I'm maxed out I'm going up as high as possible oh it always comes down to like the smallest little slope slopey slope of a difference. Um, this is also cool looking that I might try to snag it around here. Ha ha ha. Look at that. Look at that my friends. That is a crazy loop. So we've got our passenger line here. We have our goods splitting out here. And those are going to be coming in right here. No, I don't think so. This used to give, This usually gives me more trouble than good. See, so that's just that's not good, but you know what's okay? This right here. It's gonna give me... Look, I can't do that, but I can connect the lines. It's gonna give me the line connection. So I guess this is where we will have him come in to go one way. Now let me really think about this. I've gotta really think about it. All right. This is one way, and this is the other way. So can I have them connect here? No, not yet. Here, yes, yes. Okay, so let's try, let's try this. Because they're gonna come in one way here, one way here. This'll be double, this'll be double. I see how it's gonna work. I see how this is trouble too, but this is fine. This is how this works. Okay, now we got that. We are going to double it up. The nice thing is you wanna get it all the way set up. So the tip here is to have this ground to the ground like that, and then they'll connect together. If you had that bridge halfway built, this is most likely not going to work well. So now I want to connect these. Oh, this is looking beautiful. All right, 26 and 25 are done. It is now June of 1983, 1893, actually. We will hopefully play way into the future with this game. All right, so now it's time to do some signals. We're going to need a signal here, and we're going to need a signal here. And those are going to be two ways, okay? Now, here, we're going to have a signal here. And we're going to have a signal here, just for good measure. And what these are going to do is mark that this is a one way. Love this update. Love the update with the whole yes, no. It just makes a lot more sense. And we're going to one way this here. So now we just have to worry about connecting this guy. That was the hard part. The hard part is done with now. Now we need to worry about connecting these guys over here with these guys over there. All easy, doable stuff. Now, I say it's easy. It wasn't easy at all to start with, but now it's a bit easier. All right. Collision, collision. I know why there's still a collision. Let's raise this up all the way. There you go. No collision. Now I can move around a little bit better. Thank you. Ah, keeps wanting to snap, so I'm just going to put that there. Hmm, where should we have this one connect? From here to here? No, you don't like that yet? You don't like that? You don't like it? That's fine. 
You don't have to like it yet, but you have to like it very, very, very soon. All right, now this guy I want to lower down. All the way down. You going all the way down? Okay, good. Now, drop down. Drop down about there, okay? Yes, that's going to be perfect for me. Um, see how this is going to be... See, I don't... Slope too high. Collision. That's about every error you could have right there. Uh, maybe I want to go this way. Really? That's all too bad, because I'd really like to see this crawl out and work. Um, like that. Slope too high. That's funny. Okay. So that's how this is going to work. Delete that whole little fiasco. Build. Build this guy out. A nice straight line. Now we can snag this guy. And there we have it. Eventually, we will be able to meet the same ground, have the same fun. We're all one big happy family. All right. This is awesome looking. I wish I could just say double track and build the double track right now, now that I think about it. That would, that would definitely add to the easiness of this. Okay, now, ooh, uh, I made this a little crazy, so we're gonna have a little track go this way. We're gonna make a little bit of loss in time. But you know what? We're gonna be getting faster, stronger, better trains. That it's all gonna work out in the end. Here we go, look, we are within the same plane. Oh, look at that. This is gonna be cutting it close on this other track line in the road. What? What is that collision terrain madness there? Connect. Yes! It is connected. We've done it. We did it by the end of 1893. We didn't pause. We didn't do anything like that. Let's create some new lines, shall we? New line. We're going to go from cargo to our main goods here. Boom. So that should... Oh, oh, oh. Let's delete that station. Okay, see? Now that's doable. Now let's get another new line, and this is going to be our passenger line. And we're going to add a station here. Boom. And we're going to add this station down here. Boom. Now, ta-da. That's looking good. We have our one ways going, right? We have our two ways going. This is all looking good. I think I'm going to need a few more. Yeah. How does this line connect over? Yep. I see. I see what we have to do, because this guy doesn't connect over here, right? I don't think so. I think the slope is always awkward or too high or something. Something was unhappy over here. Uh, and I don't need it to be happy there. What I need it to do is be happy, like, here. I have to do a crossover there. Okay. Now, there we go. What that did was clean up my lines. Um, let's see. This is definitely two-way. Okay. Oh, it is January. Oh, no, it was just November. It was like a weird autosave moment. Okay, this is going this way. That guy's going that way. Why is the blue line all the way out here to hit this guy up again. Oh. Yeah, it would help to get this guy back. Whoop. <laughs> I had to switch over one way, but not the other way. There we go. Boom. Like that. Okay. So now the blue line cuts back over. The gold line's golden. Here we're going... Both ways, one way, one way. I will put a signal here. Boom. So the cargo truck can come up here and check and make sure, see if a passenger guy is coming. Uh, the passenger guy, I will put a signal uh, here. Okay. So if there's someone going this way, he's going to wait for him here. Uh, so they'll at least come up the line. And I think we're good. I'm going to have to work on some of the signals and stuff up here for that. 
Uh, and then just to make things easier, I'm going to throw a depot just right here at the end. And uh, even more laziness. Let's see if I can fit one right here. Just because they look cool at the end of the line like that. This, I got to say, came out to be one of the coolest looking things here. Just how it all goes up, spins around, comes around, hits up this good station, and the passenger line is going to look really nice. So what can we do for trains? Uh, we want power. Cause, and because this guy's going to have to be going up that hill. So let's get our Prussian. And this is our goods line. And we just want regular goods. So I'm going to fill it up with... I'm going to do... Let's say... Five wagons, okay? And set line to our brand new line one. And it is off! Alright, we're going to hit up this guy up here. Buy trains. Let's go Prussian. Buy a train. We're going to go with the compartment cars. So I want to buy one, two, three. This one I might do more trains and just do three. Nope, nope. I'm going to go four. Set line. Line six. There we go. We have it. We have two new trains. Already started here. Now, what I want to do is go over here and click on this guy and say, oh, what is this? Uh, I'm gonna sell all of it. I'm gonna sell the whole train. Buy train, uh, buy this. I forgot, that was one of the trains that was aging that I had to get rid of older, and I'm gonna buy, 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 and set line for line six. So I just started a train basically on both sides at the same time. Now this guy's gonna start this way, the other guy's gonna be fine over on the other side. Uh, what I wanna see now is how is this guy doing? Mm hmm. Maybe get another goods train rolling already. The goods train, actually, I should probably hold off on. All right, so this guy's trucking. Now let's go ahead and just take a view of him. And we will call this the Newport Connection, guys. Sorry, I was a little into it this episode. I was really trying to focus on building these tracks. And uh, we have it now. It's looking really, really nice. We've got some crazy roller coasters of a ride. Let's go ahead and speed this up and enjoy it. So, I don't know, guys. Let me know what you think. We've got some more stuff going. We've got every town connected now. So, it's going to be about pushing it to 1900. I'm going to play that offline. It's only about five years. Hopefully, we'll get some new stuff unlocked by then. I know we'll get a new uh, supply truck. Once we get the new truck system going, we'll be able to really focus on all of our lines, clean them all up upgrade our roads, start building electrical trains, and then I'm going to start a new series with mods. I'm really hoping to add some more, you know, challenge to the cargo. But the big tip on this is don't upgrade your mods and try to just load that into a current map that you're playing. Uh, or you will have some crashes and things like that. I would say play everything through that you want to play through now, then when you want to play around with mods, start fresh. Uh, so that would be my suggestion there, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching, and uh, hopefully we will get this going. Look, our train signals are working, our guys are moving right along, and everything's good. I've got vehicles to replace, I've got stuff to, stuff to do, train fever to work on. So, great to be back. I hope to make some new episodes soon. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Oh, 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 oh,